Hi guys, it's my face story here and today I'm going to show you how to do a full coverage acne scar makeup tutorial slash just how I do my makeup every day. Let's get started. Just woke up, washed my face, we're all good to go. Use the vitamin C cream from Vanish. Sorry, they don't make it anymore, but I'm still using what I got until now. Oh, also I'm purging a little bit right here from using my Retin-A, but that should go away in about a month or so. And I have my box of goodies. So to get started to prep my skin, I'm going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Water Primer. And this is just the smaller version. I think this one is like 15 bucks and the big one is like $30. Um, but I just really like this primer. I think it's really nice. It smooths everything out and I think it has caffeine in it too So it kind of like wakes up your skin And now I'm going to use this beauty blender or fake beauty blender and The foundation I'm going to use today is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow and the L'Oreal L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte and I'm gonna actually mix them together to get um, the foundation that I like. So I'm just gonna mix them on the back of my hand. And then I'm just gonna go in with like a tapping motion. And as you can see, it is like super good coverage. Um, this is the fullest coverage foundation that I have and I also like it because well if you're oily you can just use the matte and it has this formula in it that wicks away oil throughout the day so it keeps your skin looking like you just applied it all day um, but my skin is kind of normal now like some areas are dry some are well, I guess it's a combination. Some areas are dry, some areas are oily, so I kind of like to mix both of them. Just to get like a, I guess a normal foundation? I don't know. And I'll be looking this way because I have a mirror right here. <laughs> yeah. So if you're like, why is she like looking off into the distance? That's why, girl. And I really do like I do feel that if you spend a lot of money, well, not a lot of money, but if you spend money on skincare, I feel like you don't have to spend as much on makeup. Do you know what I mean? Like because I use good skincare, Vanish, um, I don't have to spend as much on makeup. And I did just wake up, so I'm going to be drinking my tea. And that looks pretty good, girl. So now, I'm going to go in with my concealer and I'm going to use the Shape Tape from Tarte. I love this concealer, it's super full coverage. Um, this is in the shade Fair Neutral. This is like one of their lighter shades. And I'm just gonna go like this. And I'm actually not gonna put any more concealer on um, any of the pimples I have or any of the scarring I have just highlighting the areas I want highlighted because I feel like if you try to cover it so much like if you try to keep building layers it actually settles into it more and you can see the texture more so I actually just put like a light layer on and now I'm just gonna buff this in and if you're highlighting you want to bring it all the way back here um, so it helps to like pull your eye back and I kind of blend it on my eyelid as well. Mm. 
and it never fails. I always get so much on this side and none on this side, and I don't know why. I really hope I was in the frame. I was like slouching really low. There we go. Oh, there we go. Y'all, this is difficult if you don't got the right stuff to do it with. You should see my setup. You guys would be like, what, <laughs> what is this? I'm literally just using this mirror placed off into the distance <laughs> okay so that's the face and I'm just gonna actually wait for it to dry like a little bit I don't like to put my powder on too soon because I feel like that's what makes it look cakey oh, wait did I say how much this is I think this is like $9.99 so it's pretty cheap and this is more expensive this is $25 um, but it's definitely worth it this is the only like cosmetic or like makeup that I will spend a lot of money on because it works so good um, but yeah everything else is super cheap this is the essence make me brow and it's $3.99 and this is just like the uh, benefit give me brow it's literally make me brow it's a knockoff and this is in the color brownie brows and this just works if you already have like I have a ton of eyebrow hair I don't do anything with my eyebrows I'm so lazy I literally don't even pluck them so <laughs> um, this is just gonna give you like a little bit more definition So you can see this one just has like a little bit more like definition and shape to it and it's a little bit fuller looking. And that is that for the brows. So this is what they look like. Now that my makeup has dried down a little bit more, I'm going to set it using ooh, the Fiona Styles Invisible Loose Setting Powder in shade Madison 0304. And I'm actually gonna bake underneath my eyes a little bit too. Um, if you don't know what baking is, I'm just gonna get like a little bit of extra powder and use my beauty blender and kind of set it under my eyes. And I did just get this, so we're gonna see how it turns out. Um, this whole brand actually right now, if you're interested, is 75% off at Ulta. So all her stuff is super cheap right now, so that's why I got it. It was like $9. Can't beat that. So I'm just taking a little bit on my sponge and I'm gonna put it underneath my eye. And when you do this, you want to make sure, whoo, 
You want to make sure all the creasing is gone under your eye first or else you'd just be setting um, a crease. And so with that extra powder I'll use to set all over my face once this is done bacons. Actually, I can just do that right now. And this is just a powder brush from Durabland. And so I'm going to just sweep a little bit of powder all over my face to set my makeup. So I'm just gonna wipe this excess powder off and kind of blend it in. All right, and that is it for the face. Just kidding, that's not it at all for the face. I have no clue why I said that. I'm gonna use this highlighting brush from Ulta in the NARS blush in Orgasm. And I just put it right here. And this blush is usually pretty expensive too, but I actually got this on a deal again, which is why the only reason that I got it, because I got it like half off. But um, I think full price, it's 30. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. And then I'm also going to use the Butter Blush in Plum Rose from Physicians Formula. And I think this is $8.99 or $9.99. And I'm just going to put this kind of back here. Awesome sauce. And now I'm gonna use the butter bronzer, which again, this one's $9.99. I think, guys, I don't know any of these prices. I'm just literally making these prices up. It's anywhere from $9.99 to $12.99, but it's not too bad. And I've had this for like a really long time, like whenever they came out with it, probably since last year. It lasts a long time. And this is the It Cosmetics uh, Blurring Foundation Brush, and I'm just gonna use this to like buff it in right here. And a little bit going up. And I'm not going to do my forehead because I have bangs now. And I don't got to do my forehead. I honestly don't even need to put brows on because nobody's going to see them. Except for if it's windy, then somebody might see them. And now I'm going to use this crown brush. Um, it's just a highlighting brush with the ColourPop Super Shock Cheek Shadow in the color Flexitarian. And this highlight is like, this is honestly the best formula or highlight I've ever used. I love the ColourPop highlighters. It's the only highlighters that I use. Um, look at that. You see that? Girl. Girl. I mean, that is like, that was a little bit too much. And I'm just gonna put a little bit up here. That is it for the full coverage foundation routine that I do pretty much every time I wear makeup. Um, I go back and forth between the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Pro Glow or the Tarte Confidence Pressed Powder. Those are my two favorite full coverage for acne scars. All right, guys. So this was my full coverage foundation acne scar routine. I hope this helped you hope you learned something um if not sorry i wasted your time <laughs> um and yeah this i'm not a makeup artist but this is just how i do it this is what works for me um so thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed and if you want to see 
more stuff like this or if you have any other ideas of stuff that you'd like to see um, leave a comment down below also you can follow me on instagram on my face story and that's it all right bye thank you There's a